With uh, the number of cyclists, which seems to be running into problems these days, some of them, you know, dying, etc., etc. I mean, mind you, as far as I can see, it's amazing far more of them are not injured on the roads and waiting some of them drive. I was just wondering about your Boris bikes. Do you think you should be supplying them with helmets? This is, of uh, course, a... following the sad death. I just remind my listeners, and I'm sure this has obviously touched you and your teams at City Hall as well. It was uh, earlier this week at Victoria uh, that, unfortunately, Dr Catherine Giles is the latest cyclist to have suffered a fatality. Mayor Johnson. Th- that's right. And obviously, one cycling fatality is one too many. But the fact is that the numbers certainly this year are not uh, anything out of the out of the ordinary. I think this was the second fatality uh, this year, we're now we're Maybe now nothing in, out of in, the ordinary, in, Mr. in Mr. April, Johnson, but these are two and, deaths. And uh, when you look at the numbers of deaths on the roads, uh, obviously one is is too many. But what I won't do is uh, take measures that I think are going to going to drive cyclists off the roads. So what we want to do is make it safer. And that means so investing, coming back to Ian's question, investing, investing in stuff that no, uh, improves life for cyclists and for motorists. Yes. Investing in the uh, in the roundabouts, but, in the signalling, uh, but also, but, but, Mr. Uh, but the also next time I hire training, my bike, training I? people, uh, particularly uh, bus drivers, who I think are, uh, actually have been doing much much better yes. over the last few years. But training lorry drivers as well. I hear all cy- of the cyclists above. Are going to be on the, the next time I hire. My Barclays bike, which are commonly known as Boris bike, shouldn't I be forced to have a helmet? No, I don't think so. I think the the evidence is that in uh, Australia, where they made helmets mandatory, for instance, actually what that led to was a decline in cycling overall. I think I know that people get very very worked up about this. Actually, the evidence about uh, the usefulness of cycling helmets is 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 mixed. I, I do encourage people to wear them. I generally wear one. Uh, in the summer, I don't always wear one uh, myself. I didn't wear one to come here today. Uh, Why that? Because I wear a beanie hat in in winter, is the honest answer. But that's not going to protect your head if you fall if you have an accident. I know. I, well, it, what example the, are you setting the, to younger cyclists? The, the evidence, as I say, is mixed. And um, well, the evidence is mixed about what? About the the usefulness of cycle helmets. And what if you fall off? It, there, there, there is. I'm afraid, you know, there. Are, if you look at some of the fatalities that we've had, yes, of course. Um, I'm af- I'm afraid the, it is the, not clear the that average they would, spill or they tumble would have been Mr. saved. Mayor. By a cycle helmet. I don't propose to make them. But mandatory. the average spill or tumble, surely you should be wearing a helmet. It's desirable. I, as I say, I do sometimes wear one. No, but generally, I'm nothing if not inconsistent in this matter. I do sometimes wear one, uh, and I and and but in, when it's cold, I wear. I don't. There you go. Right. Couldn't you wear one over your beanie hat? Seriously, you probably could. But well, I why don't. don't you do that? Well, because I'm not going to be bullied by you and wearing something on my head that I don't. I worry about wear. your health sometimes. Well, you're kind, but anyway, I'm just, I'm don't, I'm not, listen, folks, I'm not discouraging anybody from wearing a cycle helmet if you want. Loads of people. You've just do. said the science and is mixed, and and I, I, but I'm, I'm, what I'm saying uh, to Ian, who's asked this question, is no, I'm not going to make it okay. mandatory because I think that on balance there are other things we can do to make cycling safer. That is what we're doing.